Welcome back to the Fanboy Cantina. In this video, we're talking about Marvel Legends and the upcoming Disney Plus wave, this time focused on What If. On July 28th of 2021, Hasbro Pulse had its Fan First Wednesday live stream. It was a lot of fun watching this one, so we got the link right up above. I'd recommend checking it out. Now, this action figure obviously is not part of What If. This is Sylvie from Marvel's Loki series. This action figure was revealed through social media some weeks ago now, and it looks great. It's a great rendition with the cloak, and you can take the cloak off, and the action figure also looks great. Now, the majority of the live stream reveals, and also the topic of this video, is focused on the What If series. I'm very much looking forward to this series, and it's debuting on Disney Plus on August 11th. So first up we have T'Challa Star-Lord. What if T'Challa was picked up by the Ravagers and became Star-Lord instead of Quill? This action figure is very unique in that you can see you know, it's an animated series and so they've incorporated that into the action figure though they've applied also the photo reel technology to the head sculpt and the design so it, it looks great. Next we have Heist Nebula. So Nebula, as we've never seen her before, I haven't read anything about the episode where uh, she appears, but the action figure looks good, and yeah, that, that wig is quite unique. Captain Carter is the character I'm most looking forward to in the series and in this action figure line. This is what if the super serum is given to Agent Carter instead of Steve Rogers. This action figure looks fantastic. The rendering on the head sculpt is great. Love the Union Jack shown on the uniform as well as the shield. Just an outstanding looking action figure and I'm very much looking forward to this episode. This is Doctor Strange Supreme, so a very different take on the Doctor Strange character. He barely appears in the trailer. This seems like a worn out, uh, even more sinister version of Doctor Strange. Uh, I'm very interested in this character. Not much known about this character. This is Zombie Hunter Spidey, though I guess we could figure out that he's hunting zombies. Spider-Man barely appears in the trailer. This action figure has a cloak and a unique head sculpt there for Peter Parker and a unique outfit. We could assume that Zombie Hunter Spidey is hunting Zombie Captain America. This is a standout action figure, just unreal. You can see the, the skeletal <laughs> uh, nature of this uh, action figure. Yes, it appears in the trailer. There are holes in the limbs. The uniform is torn, like, and you can see the dangling pieces of, of fabric. Just a truly, truly unique and, you know, scary looking action figure. They picked the perfect Build-A-Figure for this line. It's Uatu, the Watcher. He does appear in the series. He shows up in the trailer. Just the perfect, perfect choice. And it's a, it's a large scale action figure. You can look at this video here, clip here and you can see how big it is. Starting on July 29th at 1 o'clock Eastern, you can pre-order this line from many, many outlets. So it should be widely available. This is a standalone deluxe action figure, the Hydra Stomper. The Hydra Stomper does appear in the trailer and you can see Captain Carter riding on the back of this thing. There are movable details like with the backpack and if you move it just so, there's, it reveals a clip and then you can reenact, you can have Captain Carter riding on the back of the Hydra Stomper. This action figure goes on pre-order starting on July 29th at one o'clock Eastern time. This is Binary, and I don't know much about this character. I had to look it up. This is part of the Captain Marvel story. This will be a Walgreens and EB Games exclusive. They are coming out with a better version of the Spider-Man Homecoming Vulture. So now more movie accurate wings, and that's a Target exclusive. This is Tigra, and they've got uh, two different head sculpts as well as alternate hands. This action figure will be on pre-order starting on July 29th at 1 o'clock Eastern Time. And lastly, they revealed a new army builder that will be forthcoming, the Hand Ninja, but in black. 
So post in the comments, what do you think? What do you think of these Marvel Legends action figures? Many of them, again, will go on pre-order starting on July 29th at 1 o'clock Eastern Time, and they should be broadly available, so go to your favorite retail outlet. On Disney+, Plus. you can catch What If starting on August 11th of 2021. As always, thank you so much for watching. Please take a moment to like, share, and subscribe. This has been the Fanboy Cantina.